everyone how are you all welcome back to my channel those of you who are new here i'm fatima i share my life and experiences with all of you to uplift yours so if you are considering uplifting your life definitely subscribe to my channel and like my page many of you have been asking me about memorial university of newfoundland and i am a proud graduate of memorial university I recently completed my master's in computer science from MAN which is a 2 years long program. To answer all of you I have started this brand new series where I talk all about Memorial University and all the programs that MAN offers for domestic and international students. In my previous videos I have discussed some master's program that computer science department offers for graduate students. I have also discussed master of artificial intelligence in my previous video. Today we are going to talk all about master of data science cause the demand of data science in today's job market is really high and some of you have asked me to discuss in detail about master of data science. So let's get started. To start researching about master of data science at memorial university and to get all the information you just have to start with a simple google search and you know what you have to search already and that is msc in computer science at memorial university after that you are going to end up into the university website or department website and from there you just have to click on master of data science button today i'm going to go over the website and discuss all the information and make it easier for you to understand all the information that you need to know about master of data science are already in the website so you just have to go through it and i'm as i said i'm going to discuss really briefly about all the information about master of data science so i have already searched msc in computer science at memorial university and i am already in master of data science page so master of data science program is offered jointly by department of computer science and department of mathematics and statistics master of data science is a one year long program which means three semesters but don't worry you are going to get 3 years post graduate work permit even if your program length is 1 year yes with the new ircc rules as long as you are into a masters program doesn't matter if it is 2 years long program or 1 year long program you are going to get 3 years long post graduate work permit so do not worry at all now let's see the admission requirements the minimum requirements to get into master of data science program is you have to have a 4 years long bachelor's degree in a relevant field relevant field as in computer science computer engineering software development or you know relevant fields and you have to have at least second class now the applicant is required to provide evidence of at least one college level course or equivalent knowledge in multivariate calculus statistical inference and computer programming in a high level programming language like r python c c++ java anything so if you already have a 4 years bachelor's degree in relevant area all these courses and programming language you are going to be okay with this requirement now for this program there are some there is one special aspect i'm going to say that is different that is the applicants who are admitted to the program shall complete three online non credit propedeutic courses and before the starting of the program so you have to take three online courses before you can start master of data science final enrollment to the master of data science program is subject to the completion of these pro propedeutic pro courses these courses cover the essentials of statistical inference basic of programming in r and python and linear algebra for regression 
the course materials as well as self-evaluation tools will be made available through Brightspace. So you are going to get access to all these three courses and also some self-evaluation tools through Brightspace. All students must submit a self-declaration statement on the successful completion of these courses prior to the commencement of their Master of Data Science program in fall term. So basically for these programs exclusively, you have to complete three online courses before you can start Master of Data Science program at MAR. And of course, there are requirements for English proficiency test. And if you are taking IELTS as your English proficiency test, you have to have minimum 6 or 6.5 to apply. These are the minimum requirements that you need before you apply for Master of Data Science. Now, let's go over the regulation. So, uh, Master of Data Science is a highly structured program and this program has 21 credit hours in courses, a case study series and a capstone project. And as I said, this program is a joint program and computer science department and mathematics and statistics department jointly offer this program. Now let's uh, have a like discussion on the courses. So there are some required courses that you must have to complete to complete your degree. And there are some elective courses that you can take from other departments. So other department means you can take some elective courses from faculties of science, business and medicine. So uh, there is a list of required courses and also elective courses in the website. You can go and have a look to see if these courses are the ones that you are looking for. Required courses are must and you must have to complete those and elective courses are important as well because you might have to take few electives and when you are taking elective from like other departments you must have to check if those courses are enlisted in the elective courses list because if those courses are not in the in approved elective course list those are not going to count towards your 21 credit hours in courses so be very careful about that when you are choosing your elective courses from other departments so among required courses there are um, they are mostly heavy on data science of course this is a master of data science program so programs are going to be heavy on data science so the list is on the website you can go and check out now comes the expenses and fees as i said these are special program and these programs has special fees so upon admission you have to pay a special fee and that fee is non-refundable that means you have to pay the fee the special fee upfront and that means that you are confirming the university that you will continue with this course but later if you want not don't want to continue with this course you are not going to get back that special fee so for Canadian students the special fee is 950 Canadian dollars and for international students the special fee is 2000 Canadian dollars now tuition per semester for new fee student like the students from Newfoundland and Labrador has to pay 1313 Canadian dollars and for other Canadian students who are not from Newfoundland and Labrador they are going to pay 1707 Canadian dollars per semester as tuition fee and for international students, the amount is 2,218 Canadian dollars per semester. So, overall in three semesters, if you are a new fee student, you, are, you have to pay 5,101 Canadian dollars. If you are a Canadian student but not from Newfoundland and Labrador, you have to pay the same amount, 5,101 Canadian dollars. And if you are an international student, you have to pay 
6761 canadian dollars now um there is a problem in the website cause tuition per semester for canadian student is 1707 canadian dollars so all together for new fee student and canadian students the amount is not supposed to be same but it's showing same here anyways you can do the basic calculation you just have to multiply the tuition fee per semester by three and you are going to get the total amount among all other programs in terms of cost in terms of your tuition fee and expenses this course is way cheaper since this is only one year long course and you just have to pay like if you are an international student you just have to pay 8761 canadian dollars including your special fee and you are going to graduate way sooner like within one year and then you can right uh, start your career right away and you are going to get also three years postgraduate work permit as i said so this is a really great program for international student or domestic student in fact whoever is really interested in data science field this is a really good program for all of you now comes when you have to apply so this program has only one intake and that is fall semester so for fall semester as you know the deadline is december 1st so all of you who are interested you have to apply within december 1st so i'm going to suggest like prepare all of your documents like your english proficiency test result your four years bachelor's degree result and also um, the courses that you need to know and also learn the programming languages these are going to help you throughout your master of data science journey as well as in your career so this is all about master of data science program and i'm going to mention another thing the uh, classes for master of data science program all uh, usually uh, in the st john's campus of memorial university so you don't have to worry about anything at all so this is all about master of data science program let me know if you have any specific question i'll try to make it clear and provide that information to all of you and in the comment below let me know what other programs that you want me to cover and discuss for you i'll see you in my next video until then take care and bye